eBay. Why do game store- why do retro game stores think Mario 3 is such a rare game? Isn't Mario 3 one of the most made games for the Nintendo? Didn't they make the most copies of, of a Nintendo game for Mario 3 considering they sold the most copies of Mario 3 for Nintendo? Oh my gosh, man. Well, there is no high demand for Mario 3. It's everywhere. Every retro gaming store I've gone to, they've had a copy of Mario 3. Who doesn't have Mario 3? Mario 3 was the number one game sold for, for the NES. The most copies of any game ever sold for the Nintendo was Mario 3. As a lot of that has to do with them selling Mario 3 with the console as well. Like, that, I think, goes into play. But regardless, I just don't understand why these game stores will sell you Mario 3 for $30, but they'll sell me a Famicom, an original Famicom, for, what, it was 60 bucks, I think it was? That's $30 more than just Mario 3. Yo, what up, man? Thank you for the good lucks. And we got the tunnel, guys. The good luck tunnel. I know there's some people out there who don't have Mario 3. I know that. It's just... When I saw Mario 3 for 30 bucks, I was like, I'm not buying that. Why would I buy that? They had Mario Kart for 64 on display. Like, what? Mario Kart is not... E that's not even close to a rare game. And... Like, I know you guys are talking about collectors, but if you're a true collector, you're not going to buy a naked game, okay? You're going to buy it with its case, its instruction booklet, and you're going to determine its quality as a whole from that. You're not going to buy just some naked game without a case or instructions. If you're a good game, if you're a good collector, you're, you're, you're going to look past that and be like, well, no, that condition's probably not even good. But I think Mario 3 complete in box, sealed, and rated is like three grand or something. Yo, look at that time. Mitch is trying to prove he's not a collector. I'm really not a collector. I own Little Samson, which is 1100 a card. I own Snow Bros, and I gave it to my friend who's a collector. That should tell you right there that I'm not a collector. He said he's been looking for a good copy of Snow Bros for like months. Months or, or like a couple years, and I had it since my... It was my childhood game. I had it since I was a kid, and I just gave it to him, man. I'm really not much of a collector. I know like what I'm saying is what like hoarders and collectors say, but like I seriously like... No. I'm really not a collector. All men collect stuff. What do I collect? I probably collect some stuff. There's, there's gotta be some things that I collect out there. But as of, I collect my candy wrappers when I eat them in bed. I put them in my drawer. That's what I collect. My garbage wrappers. I collect the hands in World 8. Thanks, guys. I collect broken hearts. Yeah, it just... Sweep those under the rug. You guys have me pegged, man, with the broken hearts. We have our interview in close to an hour now, so. Almost an hour. Is SMB3 my favorite game? No. It's not my favorite game. I 
I play SMB3 the most because whether people believe it or not, it feels really good to be good at a game. So, I am the best at this game. And it feels good to play it. Because it it's, feels really good to be good at a game. So, it just works out. I'm waiting for it. I'm not losing my power up. Whew. See, you can be like, oh, it sucks that you fell in the sand in 2 2, but like, if I didn't fall in the sand there, this wouldn't have happens right Intentional damage. <laughs> uh, lousy, that's kind of funny. Thank you, Achilles. Thank you. 
Come on, move up. You're a frig, you know that? Yo, Gregory, what's going on, dude? Decent World 3, I'm actually going to save time on my time. Jesus, an 821 World 2 is... That's so stupid. So, after World 4, depending on how it goes, that's when you'll see how much time I save or lose off this early hammer run. Yo, thank you, man. And, you know, I love you guys, too. Thanks for watching. Uh, a little slow on that battle, but... <sighs> yeah, I got early hammer. Bad move right there. Come on, boys. Thank you.
nice. That was a fantastic World 4. That was a fantastic World 4. Yo, Seth, what's going on, man? Okay, so after I split in World 4, whatever time I'm ahead by the world record is how much time that early hammer saved. So whatever whatever minus time you see when I split here, and you know most people are like, well how how much time does early hammer save? Well we don't know until we're done world four, so the one death early hammer in world two will be able to get a good visual to see how much time it saved because world four was pretty good. So I'm on pace for a 50, a 50 teen something, a 50 19, a 50 18. It's a pretty good pace. So 18 seconds ahead of world record? No, 37 seconds ahead of world record. But don't get too attached yet, guys. Too much shit has to happen. Still have to get lucky in World 5 and in World 6, where if I get unlucky in both, I can lose a lot of that time. Look at that, that's a piece of unlucky there. Oh my gosh, getting the pipe. Remember what happened last time? I didn't get in the pipe, and then I ended up getting hit by that turtle. Since when does that ever happen? Okay, so that's really bad right there. If they switch back, that's really good. If not, that's pretty bad. That's bad right there. Very bad. So this run just got worse. As I fought an extra hammer brother. And the hammer brother in the clouds keeps doing long movements. Probably down about 15 seconds now because of the hammer brothers.
Yeah, one of those Hammer Brothers I don't want to fight. I don't want to get the star. I gotta get an extra coin here to avoid coin ship. I would have had 77 if I didn't. Very risky. So I get seven here, so I'll have eight, 87. Is sub 49 possible? Not really, no. So I wanna make sure I don't get the sideways pipe jump after next level. Although I don't think it's in five seven, we'll see. Nice. Depending on what side of the screen you're on depends on what side of the screen that that chest appears on. Nice, so I get two coins, so I avoid my coin ship. There's no Hammer Brothers here, but it's also a particular roll for the next levels. By dealing with my coin count right now, I'm setting myself up for World 6 to avoid coin ships. So I'm probably going to lose about 15 seconds on the world record right now because of the long movements of the extra hammer brothers. Now I did some levels slightly faster, so maybe not 15 seconds. Maybe I'm being too harsh on myself. Nine seconds, not bad. How many hands was in Karu's run? No hands. At this rate, I can get one hand. That's it. But after World 6, it won't be like that, because I'm not even going to go for the clip in Fortress 3. The worst part about racing up against someone who got the clip is that going for the clip and missing it, you lose even more time. It sucks. That was a fun time loss. That was a fun time loss. Just bonk my face right into the wall. Good job. Good job. Nice. That right there is the cloud. It's 
swag points for headbanging. Oh my god, that's so good. That is so good. I thought I ran into that beetle. I had to have been one one pixel away from running into that beetle. All right, let's do let's do a, a good move here, guys. Come on, Hammer Brothers, give me a nice nice move here. Come on now. Nice, thank you. for this is dank down thank you I'm so dumb I should have just saved that star for the fortress in world 8 because I ain't doing the clips are you kidding me at least not right now Nice, thank you. Oh, come on. I've gotten 296 once in this level. I don't think anyone clipped it. I definitely did it on stream. I can't remember when that was. I lied to everyone. I tried it a little bit. I did a little try. Come on. Now I got a lot of movements of one here. I can't remember how many the world record gets, so I am going to say that I'm going to lose the... I'll probably lose 9 seconds off of the world record. My splits are going to gain probably 12 seconds. right close to eight seconds now a lot of that was because of the clip Thank you. 
No, my PB has one hand in it. Not again, dude. Oh, not again, man. But I'm still okay. I'm still okay. It's a good save, man. The real question is do I do I stay true to my word about doing the the auto crossing the hands or should I just st stay true to just free handing it across like pressing the inputs myself <laughs> freaking out because that time save oh my god of course uh, lending me your clothes no dice what a drag Got lucky anyways. Must be nice. Your world record is mine. No. Your world record is mine. No. Your world record is mine. No. World record is mine. No. Dude, I'm sick and tired of this, man. Every day, man. Every day I'm on world record pace and it just gets ruined by the hands, man. <laughs> 